What's up everybody? It's Sabina again. Today, we are introducing you guys to a new segment called J'adore Sundays. which is where we will pretty much just introduce to you guys African praise and worship. Right now, I have the next song, Guide Me O, performed by Koda. Live. Ooh. I love this song a lot. The bass in the song just makes it, man. I have that dashiki, the purple one. And the parts in the song just complement the instrument. Like just flows. I believe this is a hymn. I never heard the original hymn. This is the only one that I know. I wonder who arranged the instrument. The cameraman said himself. That might be the cowbell. I believe that means... Oh, I forgot. I'm not even going to try to remember. It means like lift your hands. Oh, I think this one is, um, are you feeling a song or something like that? <clears throat> and asking the people in the back. I like Koda a lot. I like his voice. Whenever you see African instrumentalists, their faces are just straight. Just, just like that. And I believe he performed a few times with Nasi. Like if sometimes you might hear a song and they'll say, um, Nasi. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's another song I should review, Bread of Life. There's not really much to the video. If anything, you can really see how Africans dress. Like you see how like just vibrant colors, that's all it is. You see the instrumentalists, their faces are always just like, they could be showing off like the, their best skills and their faces would just be stoned. I love how in the beginning, 
he in the first verse I guess you can say he did Amazing Grace so he added another hymn with an African beat and hearing Amazing Grace with the African beat just I don't know to me it made it seem like feel a little more powerful because actually the drummer at our church he can take any like any American song or just regular song and put an afro beat to it and everybody would just start flowing like what just it just puts a whole twist to everything and it moves you in a way that you didn't expect it there we go he's just talking about like God loves you so much that he took his only son to die for our sins and like that honestly it's yeah you hear that a lot but when you really stop and think about it just not like something that's a mantra that to you that oh god died for me i mean god sent his son to die for me and my sins like it's it's some it's more than that it's like his only son like imagine your only child and you sent them to die for somebody else you can't imagine any other love like it like the purest form of love is god's love and when you hear this song just he kind of repeats like i don't know why like really you don't know why god loves you so much just knowing that god can love you through it all through all the wrongdoings through all the circumstances that you're going through knowing that god is there watching over you and basically taking care of you i can testify to it myself but um wow this song takes you there <laughs> like if i continue with the video i'm just going to talk about how much i love it I, there's nothing else i can say just i love this version of the song stop the camera because <laughs> i have nothing else to say that's it that's all if you enjoyed the video please subscribe like share comment send in suggestions let us know what you think let me know if you enjoyed the um, Jador Sunday. Let me know. And um, have a blessed Sunday.